versatile company is a certified Microsoft project training partner. This tutorial is designed to give you a quick focus tip on a key feature of Microsoft Project 2010. A baseline is a static copy of planned data that's compared with actual and current data. For example, if a task starts earlier than was planned, it started ahead of time or ahead of schedule. If it starts later than was planned, it is behind schedule. The project has a Gantt chart that's designed to compare baseline dates and to visually show these differences. It's called the tracking Gantt. You set the baseline by clicking on the Project tab and then clicking on Set Baseline. Choosing Set Baseline from the drop-down list brings up the Set Baseline dialog and the baseline options. It's here that a baseline can be set for the entire project for individual and groups of tasks, and for an interim plan before implementing that plan. I'm going to set the baseline for the entire project. The gray bars that appeared represent the baseline task schedule. Once the baseline set, any changes in the plan that is different than the baseline will become obvious and immediate, assisting you in progress or status analysis. Here we see the impact of a week's delay in the starting task of a project. Projects visual reports and standard reports rely on baseline data to convey the information you need to manage the changes in schedule and the changes in work in your project. In visual reports, the information is found in the assignment usage category, in standard reports, the information is found in the current category. Note the report labels. All are based in comparisons and on comparisons to the baseline. Baselines. They help you visualize and attain your project schedule, work, and cost objectives. There's more to know about Microsoft Project 2010. Be sure to check out our other project tutorials on YouTube. For great training in project or project management, contact us at www.versitalcompany.com.